black hoodie, I'm back cooking these goodies. Look at these views from cooking these foods. Yeah. As you'll observe, I'm back in the whip. Things worked out nice. I got the dump run done here today. It's mid afternoon. I'm grumbling. And I've been meaning to try this place for a long time, but it's just way out of my like area code type thing. Or we're out in the butt fuck nowhere boonies kind of thing. But it's a gas station slash like groceries and eatery on the side of a kind of highway-ish major road, country back road near the dump. So I figured let's get two birds stoned at once, a Rickyism. But um, I saw on Facebook and their Instagram that they sell smash burgers and other delights. To be honest, they look like some of the best burgers I've ever seen advertised in my city uh, on the outskirts in the boonies. So today we try, I'll give you a little, give you a little hey, how are you of the store's little front here. The pumps are closed, but that's what it is. Dawson General Store, major traffic, 18 wheelers. <laughs> but I'm gonna go get some stuff. I don't know what I'm getting yet. Definitely a burger. And then we'll chit and chat and try this food. All right, I went a bit crazy, y'all. First things first, these burgers are way bigger than I expected. They're pipe and hot, they just came out. She gave me a smiley face for the distinction on my customized one, which is more like a breakfast style burger. This is their classic. And then right as I was paying, literally they brought out this fresh, hot, by the slice pizza pie. And I was like, four bucks for a slice. It's not like, you know what I mean? Ham, cheese. I thought there was jalapeno on there, but it's mushroom. But I had to, I had to give this a go while I was sitting and waiting to pay. So we're gonna look at that. I'm gonna actually unravel these mysteries and let them kind of come cool down a bit. It's because they are so hot and show you them hot and fresh. So let me do that one sec. All right, so the first one we're gonna unravel and address is their classic smash offering. The one that they sell their main offering and oh my god holy crap oh no that looks already they got the good pickles they got the crazy good smash this is looking absolutely insane the melty cheese oh ho, 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 ho. that house made bun and that special house made sauce with perfectly sliced onions. This skirt and crust. This is insane. This place should be in town and making a killing. Can't wait to taste it. That looks insane. Then I got cocky and said like make me a breakfast style burger. So they put their in-house smoked bacon, cheese, the uh, fried egg and the house sauce on this one. I did ask for aged cheddar, but I don't see any age. Oh, this is the aged cheddar. It's not white, it's orange aged cheddar maybe, right? Let's see. Yeah, that seems about right. Okay, yo, I have not been this excited for some local food in a long time. Uh, I got the AC on mild. Hopefully that's not too controversial. Uh, we'll talk about some things, but really this food is what matters to me most right now. But a uh, very, very cold, it's hot out today. Green tea, one of my favorites. Green tea iced tea from Arizona, it goes down so buttery smooth. 
honey, like almost honey smooth. Let's call, let's call it. Okay. Got cocky, messed around, got way too much food, spent 30 bucks, but whatever. I'll, I won't be out here again, you know, for this is a one off adventure. And it's a celebration of good luck that my truck was able to get fixed on the cheap. So we're doing this. But yo, look at this little pizza pie that just came out. Unbe Unbelievable. I'm not just saying it. The sauce and the crust. The sauce. Wow, the sauce. It goes absolutely dummy. The crust. Crinkly. Wow. Perfectly gluteny, crispy bottom. I saw their Instagram and their Facebook like, oh my God. A couple months ago and everything looked so proper. I just never thought to make it out here, but. Wow. I'm actually blown away. Just this alone, just this pizza. Should be a restaurant in the city. In its own right. That's crazy. All right, next up. This burger, insane looking. Look at that bottom. These are all fresh baked house buns, house everything really, I think. Cause this place is like, has all locally sourced, like local product, local meat, local dairy, local cheese, that's dairy, but local milk. Uh, you'll see in the little clips that I gave in like Slate River Milk. I'm oh, sorry, Slate River Dairy Farms. Slate River's right around here. Look at the crust on that. That goes crazy. Okay. This is... Oh. Wow. What? What the fuck? Absolutely. This is insanity. I didn't even know this could exist in my city. The bun. They're like a cloud. It's like a milk bun, kind of. The beef. Oh my God. The crisp that you can taste from that crust. Sauce is perfect. Cheese is perfect. Look at that bite right there. Come on. They mandoed off the pickles perfect. And the, I'm sacrificing. No, I can't sacrifice this perfect bite. But look, like, they even did. They got the mandolin shaved onions. Like I've always said. Said. Not by it. I'm just happy right now. Whoa. Oh my God. I'm 
I'm sorry I keep showing you, but I've been on the hunt for a burger like this. For so long. I'm just in heaven right now. This is one of the best burgers I think I have ever had. And they know they know about those good pickles. After this, I'm going to tell them, the lady, that this is the best. One of the best burgers I've ever had in my life, but definitely the best food I've ever had in my city, like in terms of this style of food. If this was in town near me, it would be problematic for me. I hear this. This burger, $8. That is a good price for this burger. Put this in a restaurant, 18 bucks. Easily. These days, man, whoever's responsible for their kitchen, standing ovation from this guy, sitting ovation. <laughs> from this time. <laughs> Crazy. I kind of knew I shouldn't have done it. I'm only going to have like a bite of this. I'm much too, this is much too heavy, much too full. I'm going to take this home and I'll eat it later, but or give it, I don't know, give it to like my mom or something because I'm going to her house right now to do yard work, but I got to try a bite. crazy good impossible not to be but i'm gonna save that because i can't eat that right now it's way too way too much food and i honestly need another bite of this pizza the pizza is incredible honestly some of the best pizza i've ever had too You know what? I'm gonna just leave it at that. As far as my truck goes, we'll talk about it in the next one because I don't even want to drag this one out. That was just a food heaven. But I'm lucky to to have my truck back. We'll talk about it in another one. That's all this has got to be. Honestly, I need another bite of this pizza. Um, I'm I'm just. It's so good, but it's oddly enough, it's the, it's the marinara. Our sauce is incredible. And I'm not even like a really saucy marinara guy. Right? I always douse with ranch and shit, but wow. All right. I enjoyed that one. Until the next one, you could live well. Stay true. If you like this content, please like, comment, and subscribe, as well as check out my pinned comment down below to find other ways to support this channel.
Thank you for watching. Eat good, live well, and stay true.